Hey everybody, we're back with more Chronicles of Dark Lord Episode 2, War of the Abyss. Uh, we're in um, the Cenefaria Fortress. Let's uh, explore and talk to people. I can't talk while I'm on guard duty. I'd go with you, but there is too much for me to do here for me to do. Be careful, no one has visited those ruins in over a year. I know I'm not supposed to talk while I'm on duty, but all I can say is wait until you see the ship. Indeed, it's pretty fucking awesome. Eh, there's a medial potion there. Okay. That ship is going to turn the tide for us, once it's activated, of course. This fortress is one of the few remaining bastions of our world's forces that are left. Usually we get attacked by the enemy every few days, but we haven't seen any abyssal forces recently. Think they're planning something? I'm sure they are. Oh, let's go down here real quick. Yeah, because there's a Sokopia. Alright. The ship we discovered is currently being restored within the fortress. Using an ancient ship of the past to fight the world's current enemy. Sounds rather fitting, doesn't it? That's pretty badass. Emperor Magus, please feel free to purchase any armor you need from our Quartermaster. The Quartermaster has been a bit upset lately. Supplies have been slow coming in ever since the Abyss took control of the seas from City and Rose. There's a medial potion. I think there might be one other thing here. Nope, okay. So this is the guy you buy armor from right now. I've got some decent armor here, if that's what you're looking for. You're gonna have to buy them, though. These things don't come cheap during wartime. Alright, so they have, um, Jedi equipment and sapphic. Jedi plate mail, Jedi helmets. Alright, that's all I can afford right now. I might have some stuff to sell, though. Alright, now let's see. Alright, so let's see. I need two of those, one of those, and one of those, so... We'll come back. Cenefire Tower is a rather hard area, so you do want to do some leveling up there as well. So the first time I go in, I'm probably just going to clear out the first floor of enemies, get some treasures, and then come back and buy more armor and such. I already talked to you. Let's go down here real quick. Yeah, there's a Sokopia there. and a smelling salt. I want to be out there fighting, not patrolling the same hole for hours on end. Here's the commons. The kids around here are trying to make the best of things, but we all know they're scared. They have every right to be, because I am too. I see so many new people coming in every day, all saying they lost their homes. This is the last home I've got. I don't want to take it away. My mom said this is the safest place in the world right now. I don't know, though. Well, for now, she's probably right. Even if the ship does fly, then what? How's one ship going to take down the barrier? I don't know if you guys have heard yet, but the barrier's gone. The discovery of the ship couldn't have happened at a better time. We need to take the fight to the Abyss for a change. It's still amazing to me how much we've accomplished here since over a year ago. The Emperatrix is truly a great woman. And there's a villain room. You headed to the tower rooms? Be careful, the Ganari have claimed what's left of that tower for themselves. You won't find anyone else around here with a better deal for items. I don't need items right now. Even in these darkest times, you must keep strong. I have heard that most of the Rim Kingdoms have either been destroyed or absorbed into the Abyss. I used to run Laurel's Tavern here in the fortress, but it was destroyed during the last attack. <sighs> Alright, so that's all very, very depressing. Move on down this way. Alright, here we are in the Cenefaria region. 
So we're going to head up to uh, the Ruins of Senefari Tower, get some money, gain some levels, that kind of thing. And then we'll be coming back to buy better armor. So there's a couple of things I couldn't buy yet. But you do need to start concentrating on getting higher levels, uh, since enemies have become stronger. And uh, remember, we haven't uh, leveled since the, these characters. They were in Chapter 1. Remember, our objective is to find that crystal to power the ship. Keep in mind as well that traps set upon us last year may still be active. And they definitely are. Okay, those holes are spikes. You don't want to step on any of them. Puppies! Yeah, they're tainted wolves, but they're good. I call them puppies. Oh! Dodge. I'll just show you, um, she doesn't have any new conjurer abilities quite yet. You gotta, you gotta go up with the Scion Grid. No one bites the dust. Come here, you. Alright, we got, uh, werewolf strippers here. They're actually called lichens, but... To me, they'll always be werewolf strippers. Boom! God, I did give it Prey Venom. I should start using that when I can. It does hit all the enemies. Even if it doesn't uh, poison the enemies, it will do some damage, so there is that, too. I'm gonna heal Dasan right here, though. See, even if you're not poisoning the enemies, you are damaging them, so there is that. I got a potion out of that, too. And there's a medial leaf. They're gonna be very careful about moving around here. Got two puppies. I even poisoned one of them. that it was necessary, but there you go. Okay, so they give you... What these give you is they give you sort of jumbled names. It's for a puzzle that's going to be happening. Right, Venom. Oh, so close. So close yet so far. Thank you, Isis. I'll try and get everyone up at least a level before I move back to Cenefaria. Blue lobsters! I've never had a blue lobster, I've had plenty of red lobsters. So those are uh, uh, Skypuses and there's a Kirpus, so... As you can see, we, just got, we do have some new enemies. Blocked it. Take you out now. Sting in the tail. Oof. Ouch. Ouchie, ouchie. We're gonna have to uh, do something about that. As such. And you die. Natus is getting close. See one of those traps hanging out over there. All right, two more blue lobsters. Pretty much had a juice for everything, but just hitting them with a normal spell. Stinging tail. Stinging tail again. I think everybody just attacking him normally. Should be good enough. Jesus, with the stinging tail. Stop that. I don't like it very much. Oh, so close. 
Might as well just let it hit me now, so I'm not going to worry about it later. If you walk long enough, you won't be stunned at the beginning of the next battle, so... Okay, there's... Negate, though. 100 stair in there, and there's that one. Yeah. That negate is still on me, though. On everybody but the sun. Oof! Come on now. There we go. No, it's not on Isis either now. And after this battle, it won't be on anybody. Alright, I'm like a little ragged, and I don't want to be using too many like items and shit. So probably, actually, you could just kill him here. Yeah. Oh shit. All right, Dasan. After this battle, I'll head back to Senaforia Tower, and uh, that should be good. Magus has been reached level six. Chris has reached level six. Not everybody's level, but uh, that's my phone. What's going on there? Let's see. Sorry about this, guys. No, it's just Facebook. Okay. Sorry about that. Well, let's go back to Cenefaria Tower and uh, use the crystal, and we'll see about getting ourselves a little bit of uh, that sweet, sweet, better armor. The stuff that I didn't buy before. see. I need two of those, one of those, and one of those. So I have just enough money. Right, I'm going to go use that crystal. And then we're going to go back in. We're going to kick some Ganari ass. And I'm still going to fight every enemy I see because, you know, we need to gain levels. That is important. I'm going to get some treasures. And we're going to get down to the bottom and it's going to be cool. Get a crystal going. First, we do this. Actually, I would like to save this. Let me save it. I'm going to continue going for now, but I do want to save it. Just in case something goes bad. You never know. Rock and or roll. <laughs> Alright, let's once again start hunting down Ganari. We want to kill as many as possible. Oh, very nice. Great venom. Didn't poison anybody, but I got good damage out of it. That's, you know. That was like two of Christus hits, you know? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, Isis is stunned. That's not very happy. Oh, come on, really? Really? Werewolf strippers. Now Chris is stunned. Isis is no longer stunned, but actually she only got 13 hit points. Just fucking knock him out. Ooh, Isis so close to the level leveling. Get back here. Get back here. I need to kill you, wolves. Probably have this on take them both out here. Yes. And Isis has reached level six. Alright. There we 
we go. Yeah, we got a werewolf stripper and a wolf puppy. Oh yeah. Very nice. There we go. Stun claws. Oof. Got her good, huh? Damn. Uh, the sun's getting there. Um, let me just uh, potion myself up a little here. Just a little bit. Get them blue lobsters going. Get up back here, you fucking blue lobster. Lobster fest in the world of Korra. Oh, the fuck's wrong with me? Oh, so close. Kill it, Dasan. We need to eat it. And of course, there's always bats. If you played video games, you know there's always bats. Alright, there we go. Stripper werewolves. Take them out. I don't think I need spells here. Well, ouchie. There we go. Certainly a lot, of, a lot of enemies, but... I mean, like I said, you really need this. You need to grind up a little, or you're gonna have a really, really bad time with the coming parts. Alright. There we go. Enough. And you really don't want to step on the spikes, because they do a fucking gang of damage, dude. It is really unpleasant to hit the spikes. Oh, yeah! Come here, you! Oh, nice! That was perfect. Kill these damn things. Alright, Isis is in a little bit of trouble there. She can't cheery her way out of. And you die. And the sun has reached level six. Oh, well. That's Tanya, a bit late, but there she is. Jesus. Nobody's missing. Hold on. Oh, good. Let me tell her on my phone. Alright, that there we go. Kill it! Don't you do that? That is Magus's daughter. That is not something that you do to her daughter, because. Last time a, a guy put his stun claws on Dasan, it was not pretty. May just went totally nanners. There we go. Alright, let's start. Oh. There's also a lobster I missed. Two bats! I'm sorry, carapace! Whatever the hell you want to call them. I call them Bat Souffle. You die. Hold on. I see you there. Oh, yeah! I see you there. Walking around. I see your ass, boy. Yeah, 
and you die. You don't have 22 damage, I'm gonna fuck you up. Stupid bat. Go all Castlevania on you. The son does have a whip after all. Alright. Alright, maybe Symphony of the Night then. Alright, you're dead. There's one over here too. I really want to just exterminate. Ah! Fucking hell! Oh, I was trying to avoid that. Shitty balls. They are the shittiest of balls. I don't want to go too crazy like ethers and shit, because I know there's crystals coming up, you know, fairly soon, but, uh... Sting in the tail! Also, don't want to die. Slappy, slappy. Oh! I, that was the same one. I couldn't see it because of Krista. Alright, I'm just gonna go ham on these fuckers. What's this? Skill Scion. Oh, I don't want to use it here. It'll respawn everything. Fuck. Even just looking at the Scion grid respawns the enemies, so... Fuck you. Come here, you bat fucker. You fuck bats. Terrence, why did you call me a bat fucker? Well, Philip, you fuck bats. All right. I don't know, it just doesn't have the same ring. Hey, shut your fucking face, bat fucker. It, it, it doesn't work. Uncle fucker works perfectly. There we go. See? The engraving is unreadable. Oh, I guess we don't gotta read it. <laughs> Troll lol. Ah! Oh! Go ahead, do it, do it. Yeah. Yeah. Almost done with this floor anyway. I didn't have much in the way of magic points anyway, so. This would have been a really good time to use Prey Venom, but uh, no. Thank you, Krista. Venom slice here, though. Anything that can mitigate. Locked it. Oh, Isis, you had one job. Thank you, Jason. There we go. Oh, your mother. Yo. Hmm. And your mother. Well, shit. She didn't have any mana for you to drain anyway. Ah, you're missing. Alright, may just finish the fucker off. Okay, cut him in half. You know, you wonder. There we go. Close to another level. Let's see. Ooh, yeah. Oh, that guy. Alright. Alright. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm negated. Hold on. I just want to see if there's a crystal around here. I don't think there is. That's a treasure there, though. Skill sign. Alright, I'm just going to, like, go and do this just because, like, the enemy, you know, the. I'm running a little ragged here, and the video's getting kind of long, so... And I did fight a bunch of guys here before, so... Oh, I gotta hit all four of them first. I know the answers. Ah, I'm gonna go ham on you, motherfucker! Just one fucking blue lobster. And the gate is already worn off. Not that I need it. Motherfucker. Alright. Hitting those 
spikes really put a dent in it. A faint voice is heard within the stone. You must answer my questions to achieve your objective. Fail, and you shall face an echo of the past. My essence is fading as time goes on. We must do this now. It is now time for your first question. There was a woman whose heart was full of fire and passion in the ancient past. What was her name? Now, if you looked at the jumbles before, you kind of know what the first letter is. And plus, if you played the first game, um, you would know the answers already. So that's Alistra. By the way, if you noticed before, the ship that Ziri and Galena on was called the Alistra. So there's another way you can remember that. This man beheld darkness as a friend rather than a foe. And the mystery that surrounded him continues to this day. What is his name? Well, that would be Sakal. This particular warrioress was heralded for her sense of righteousness and bravery in the face of certain death. What was her name? Well, that was Kailana. The tides of fate that swept this... Oh, see, he said it! The tides of fate that swept this man from the arms of his beloved was the cause of his brandished fury that consumed him. What was his name? That was Elric. Impressive. I grant you a just reward and shall open the path you seek. So you get a quick and scroll, a skill scion, and three attribute scions, and the path opens. So let's see if we can just get to the next map so I can use my scions without spawning a million enemies. Okay, uh, that's a side scrolling area anyway. Alright, let me just go into the scion grid and do this shit. Let's, uh, let's get to Sun squared away. So they will learn Belius, which summons the Shenandorian god of flame. Oh, gotta do this one first. And there's Prey Blind. And plus one to magical attack power. I'm actually gonna go over to Isis now since she is the healer. Airblade or Curena, that's what I wanted. Curena, plus 5 to maximum magic points, plus 10 to maximum hit points, and I don't have any more skill scions left. I might have attribute scions though, so let me check by going to mages. Oh, actually I couldn't use them anyway because he's got skills on the end, but let me just see something here. No skills, no attributes. Oh, so I'm out of scions. Alright, so I am actually going to stop here and I will continue later. I will see you guys then.